This new Vans Ave 2.0 is the most technical skateboard shoes that I ever seen. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ness. If you are new to the channel, this channel provides a lot of product review, specifically footwear design. And sometime here and there, I will sneak in a couple of clothing pieces that I think that are interesting to share with you guys. And they always include few different looks to give you guys ideas how to styling with the product. Because no matter how good the product looks, in the end of the day, you got to wear the show. In this video, I'm very excited reviewing this new model from Vans, the F2.0. Uh, surprisingly, this shoes perform very well, even though I'm not a skateboarder, but the technical part on this shoe is very good. Uh, definitely, it's a great model in design-wise. Um, Aesthetic-wise, you can see yourself wear a lot of different style in the shoes either you want to go with techy looks or you want to go with the casual wear every day it does the job well in the past i also done quite a few new model release from vans i think the latest one that i done my video review and styling with the shoes is the new school the new school to me is the next icon to the old school because I've seen a lot of people wearing them on the street. And hey, I done the review video on the new school too. If you're interested, I'm gonna leave the link in the description box below. And the pricing on this new model though is $130. I would say it's the most expensive Vans model that I ever purchased. But compared to the spec on this model, I think it's worth it. Uh, if you really a hardcore skateboarder, I would recommend you to try out the shoes. The fitting though is amazing. Fit like a club, especially around the forefoot and in the back of the heel counter, this TPU heel cage, they are very well built. They also give you a very snug fit and also stabilize your ankle as well. Uh, for those who are afraid of this tight fit in the midfoot, over time it's gonna stretch. So do not worry about the tight fit around the midfoot. But that type of fit is good for those who are planning to skating on this show. If you can really handle that tight fit in the midfoot, then go half a side up. But do not go one side up because when I wear the shoes in my choo-choo side, I already have a gap in my toe. I think the shoes last that I use on this model is a little bit elongated. So uh, definitely do not recommend you to go like a whole side up. This model currently they release two different colorways. First is the black and white colorway. The other colorway is the cream colorway. I think these two colorway is a great colorway to introduce their new model. Um, go to the toe area. They use Michael Sway's material overlays. At the VAM, they have perforated toes for breathability and the high frequency design detail at the toe. And when you look on the top down view on this Michael Sway's pattern piece, you can see they are asymmetrical. In the lateral side, they are longer than in the middle side. This pattern piece, they really follow the human foot anatomy. And the lacing system, in the first three eye row, they use the Michael Sway's eye stay. Um, what I like about this construction in the lacing system is the knit material under the lace is they are very stretchy they give you a better fitting as well and on top of the tongue they have gel prints vents up the wall ave in white i really like this tongue top line because it's long enough for me to stuck in my pants cup very nice for styling part uh, and also the design aesthetic on this top line look very cool too in the quarter, I would give credit to this 
jazzy line. They look very cool and modern. I like how these jazzy lines at the back of the heel counter, they kind of faded away. Very cool touch on the design detail on the branding logo. In the back of the heel counter, I already mentioned this, they have the molded TPU heel cage. But inside the lining around the heel counter, they have the paddings around your ankle, so give you that comfort. And if you look farther inside of the shoes, you can see they use the backing material wrap around your forefoot and under the eye stay area. The construction inside of the shoes is really connected to some of my performance sneaker running shoes from other brand. They really focus on the technical part of the shoes. They want to creating number one skateboarding shoes in the world. And you can see that statement inside of the shoes Vans World number one skateboarding shoes. Now we go to the outsole tooling. I think this outsole tooling is very exciting for Vans because in the midsole you can see the ultimate waffle new technology from Vans through this clear TPU piece in the midsole. In the back of the midsole, you can see they still have that iconic vents up the wall patch and go to the rubber outsole tooling. The pattern, they still have that waffle inspired pattern. And if you compare it to the outsole toolings on the classic to this new model from Vans, um, the classic one, the outsole pattern, they more like a sharp edge. This one, it's a little bit rounded all around the edge to give you a better movement. Even though I'm not a skateboarder, but I truly appreciate every single detail on the shoes. Uh, the designer that designed the shoes, they're really thinking about the performance for sure, um, the technical part on the shoes for sure, uh, from the toe all the way to the heel counter. Um, I really love this heel counter fit. Give me a very good snug fit at the same time they stabilize your ankle. Again, for those who are thinking this shoe is a little bit too tight, too narrow, um, then just go half a side up. But the engineer knit upper always needs to be a little bit tight fit in the beginning. Over time, it's gonna stretch. Um, definitely give me the feel of the performance type of shoe on this model for sure. And styling with the shoes, I go a little bit techy look on this model because you know the shoes is black and the shoes also very technical so i gotta go for tech wear and up next i'm gonna share with you guys my three different looks i create with the show So there you have it. What do you think about this new model from Vans AVE 2.0 Knit Show? Uh, I would recommend you to try them on because I think the shoes is very well built. For those who are really into skateboard, this shoes is perhaps one of the, maybe the most perfect shoe for skateboarding uh, because all these spec that they have on the shoes is crazy. A very performing base. And if you like one of the look in this video, give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can wait to share with you guys. I'm out.